after us. Yeah. So well, now you don't know what to do. <laughs> we're now um, in trouble. Okay, here we go. Hey everyone, this is Nia at Buffalo Modular Homes, and we have not brought you a Meet the Team member video in a long time. So today, yeah. Jonathan's in the hot seat. Everybody, meet Jonathan Griffiths, one of our sales and design team members here at Buffalo Modular Homes. We're so happy to have you here. You didn't really have a choice, so. That's true. Thanks yeah. for joining me. <laughs> um, I have a couple rapid fire questions that he knows nothing about, which makes sounds, it exciting. Sounds great. Um, but Jonathan, why don't you introduce yourself, tell the people a little bit about you and what you do here at BMH. Yeah, uh, well, my name's Jonathan, as Nia has said. Um, I do sales and design here at uh, Buffalo Modular. I come from a design background and uh, construction. I've been around construction my whole life. My dad used to own a construction company as well, so I've uh, been around job sites forever. So Awesome. And you have a great eye for design. What are your favorite things to design in a new home? Oh, uh, for sure kitchens, um, absolutely. So I feel like kitchen is really the centerpiece uh, of the home, especially as more open concepts are happening. Um, you know, the mm -hmm. kitchen really kind of uh, forms the design for the rest of the home. There's so much, uh, so much in that. Absolutely. Uh, are you the one cooking in them? Uh, baking at home. Oh, baking. baking. Yeah, my wife well, cooks. I do the baking. Okay, yeah. sounds like we need to have a, the uh, great British baking show here at Buffalo Modular Homes. That would be great. Homes. <laughs> uh, I will gladly taste some. I do not bake, but I like to eat baked goods. Um, so Jonathan is with us. He brings a lot to our team. We're so grateful for him. Um, also, he, his wife Lisa, they have three kids, similar. Right. So can yep. you tell us a little bit about What's going on at home? Yeah, so uh, we have three. Uh, our oldest is Huxley, he's six. Uh, then Jonas, he's three. And then Leona is six months, yeah. So very similar. We had a little girl and yeah. Lyra. We and basically then... just did whatever you guys did. That's exactly, did. Yeah. you know, mm -hmm. it's, it's very, yeah. uh, it's, it's trending. Yeah, <laughs> so, um, so great family life, a lot going on. And here we, we have a couple rapid fire questions. Perfect. Okay, Perfect. here we go. Jonathan, what is your favorite drink? Uh, seltzer water. I don't know what he's going to say. It's very <laughs> exciting. Number two. Hopefully nothing offensive. What? No, I took those <laughs> out. Um, which subject were you worst at at school? Uh, in high school, I was worst at English, although I did really good in high in uh, college English for some reason. So like they didn't like my writing. Too. Oh, yeah. you were okay. Writing. Yeah. I think yeah. it, your handwriting. Well, I was left-handed, so oh. erasable pens were a big thing, no, and so good. you're erasing your handwriting as yeah. you're writing the whole time. Yeah, it's it's, it's a writing world yeah. out there. Yeah. Plus, it? my hand turns blue, so it doesn't. And then, terrible. like, it's hard if you have like a trapper keeper. Right. Remember the trapper? No <laughs> right. one. I'm dating myself. Okay, <laughs> which subject were you best at school? Math, for sure. Math. Yeah. Okay, math guy. That makes sense. Architecture, design. That's right. It's good. What advice would you give your young self? Oh, um, yeah, wow. Uh, what advice would I give my young self? Um, uh, trust your ability to make good decisions uh, because you can make better decisions than you think you can. Oh, I like it. I needed that too. Okay. <laughs> um, what scares you? What scares me? Uh, dancing scares me. Wow, interesting. Yeah, and yeah. your son Which and my is... son were just in a hip hop dance class, and yes. his son was actually out there dancing. And what was my well, son doing? Well, he was this? doing things. Let's not go so far as I mean, to say he was it dancing. was like it was like dance fighting, <laughs> right. some kung fu. Right. Um, but no, our son Nigel, uh, Jeremy, and I love to dance. And what is he doing? He has his arms crossed, saying, "When is this going to be over?" Well, so. my wife loves to dance as well, so you know she usually pulls. I I don't. I'm not reluctant. She knows that I don't like to dance, so okay. we'll get out there for a dance or two at a wedding. You just don't want to do done. like the yeah. Cupid Shuffle. Yeah, exactly. Okay. I mean, the organized dances are better because then I know what I'm supposed to then do. Then great, so. the Macarena, yeah. the Cupid Shuffle. Exactly. But if you have to just freestyle, There's, that's scary. That's not a thing. Yeah. Okay, next one. If you could live anywhere in the world, where would it be? I mean, I do love living here, especially on days where the sun is out like it is yeah. right now. Um, it's a nice feeling. Geez, otherwise, uh, I haven't been to enough places. Um, I would probably want to live in the mountains somewhere. Oh, so, in the mountains. Um, okay. I've been to the Adirondacks a lot, so um, so probably there. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm sensing an outdoorsy vibe here that I don't know about. But <laughs> what's your hobby? What's a hobby you have? Uh, photography. Oh, photography. Yeah, I love photography. Baking. Mm -hmm. Okay, yep. this is good. Um, favorite food? Oh, um, 
I don't know. All of my wife's new creations are always very good, so that's hard to say. That's a good um, answer, Jonathan. Anything your <laughs> wife makes, that she is, is an a fantastic answer. cook. Fantastic <laughs> cook. Yes. Um, Jeremy would just, you know, he doesn't have a choice. I say, here's dinner. If you like it, or Chipotle's now across the street. So that's the other option. If you could be any animal, what would it be? Um, probably a fox. I don't know why I have this affinity for foxes. I think they're a fascinating okay. animal. Because you so. just want to know what the fox says. <laughs> yeah, right, right. Okay, that'll never get old. Um, that's really all I have for rapid fire. But okay. if you viewers out there have a question for Jonathan, then put it in the comments below. But if you haven't yet set up a, a meeting for Buffalo Modular Homes and you're interested in building, Jonathan will be happy to meet with you either in person or over the phone, over right? The phone, yeah. You do, okay, phone meetings yep. as well. Um, and what's one thing that you really love when work with working with customers since starting BMH? What's something that you yeah. enjoy doing? Great question. Um, I love designing the whole home, like being able to work through uh, the layout. I, you know, I got my background in, in civil engineering. I considered architecture, but I ended up doing civil engineering, so I used to do estimating and stuff like that. I love uh, working through the layouts of a home and really making it functional for what the family needs. Awesome, great. Well, we're so grateful to have you here. And uh, for any of you out there, if you're thinking about building, I know Jonathan is great at just easing the fears and bringing you through the whole process. So we'd love to get to uh, know what your dream is and see if we can make it a reality. So thanks for watching. Have a great day. See ya. Okay.